Well, good day, everybody. This is Chris of the Ancient Scholar. I hope this video finds you all doing well. Uh, so it's about uh, 10 o'clock at night. I just uh, finished up with an after work mountain bike ride, and now I need to uh, get home and get to bed post haste because I've got an early start at work in the morning. But uh, what I wanted to do is I wanted to do a quick video uh, that is completely different from a lot of the videos I've done, and I just want to talk about some uh, pieces of equipment that I tend to carry on my, my person at uh, pretty much all times, and this sometimes would fall under the umbrella of something known as EDC or everyday carry. And these are these are edged tools or bladed tools uh, that I carry uh, pretty consistently. And I have two specific ones that I'm gonna talk about tonight. And I carry them for slightly different reasons and the environment is actually, they're, they're more a function of the specific environment I happen to find myself in. And so let me just uh, show them off to you. So the first one is uh, this device here, this tool here. Uh, I carry this pretty much uh, everywhere when I'm not at work. And this is a, a Benchmade and uh, this looks like a bug out which is a very popular design, but this is actually the smaller kid brother of the bug out. This is the Benchmade mini bug out. Uh, so it is a smaller, shorter, slightly thinner version of the bug out. And you can see that I have the one in this white color uh, and that some people sometimes refer to this as the Stormtrooper knife. So you can see it's very small. Uh, the blade is just a bit under three inches. Uh, so it's very compact, very easy to carry, has a very small footprint, and it's just nice to have on your person if you need to cut, cut an envelope open or open a box or cut tape or uh, cut rope or twine or zip ties, uh, things, cables, mounts, things of that nature. This is a really good option. Has a nice small footprint and uh, aesthetically it's quite appealing. Uh, so I really like this knife. And of course it has the classic uh, Benchmade locking mechanisms, very sturdy, not a whole lot of flex and uh, very easy to use. Now, when I'm at work, well, when I'm at my, my job at the college, uh, carrying knives, particularly by faculty, would generally be frowned upon, but I work in a department where we have an incredible amount of equipment that comes in and out. And so we're always getting boxes in that are taped up, uh, that you're cutting straps and uh, ties and tape and opening boxes and gathering equipment and all that. And so it really helps to have access to a utility uh, knife of, of sorts. And so uh, what I carry when I'm at work is uh, something that has a very small footprint and it does not look like a knife and it's not really a traditional knife, it's really a utility uh, knife of sorts and it is this here. So you can see this is very interesting looking and this is actually made by a company here in the United States, uh, I believe in Oregon and the company is known as the James brand and this specific device is called the Palmer and you can see that it is fairly flat. So it is flat, it is very thin. Uh, it's made of uh, uh, aluminum alloy. Uh, I have the nice, I think this is called coral red, the color, it comes in several colors. There's this reddish color, there's a blue color, a black, a gray. Uh, I think there's a yellow color as well. And uh, it has a hole with some 550 cord that goes through it. And so it is very unassuming looking. It doesn't look like anything is edged, uh, but it contains a razor blade and a standard razor blade will fit in it just fine. And then you have this uh, button and slide on top. You push it in all the way up and you can see that um, a blade, the razor blade comes out part of the blade, not a whole lot, but just enough to cut boxes open, cut tape, things like that. Um, so it's really nice, really slick. And another thing that I really like about this particular device, the Palmer, if you push in and you go a halfway, you can easily remove uh, the razor blade and replace it with a new razor blade. 
and it's that easy. So it's very easy, very unassuming. If we compare it to the Mini Bug Out, uh, they are approximately the same length. Uh, the uh, Palmer is a bit thinner, but it is a bit wider, right? So the footprint is uh, very different. Um, it's approximately the same footprint, but just from an aesthetic standpoint, it is very uh, non-threatening, very unassuming.